that gpt is making it really easy for you to create custom personalized designs on etsy these designs are going to explode in sales and if you miss out on this opportunity you could be missing out on making a huge amount of sales in your etsy business so in today's video i want to share with you this top trend product that's going to explode for father's day where you can actually create just in a few seconds with utilizing ai with chat gpt and a little bit of personalization to make your product stand out even more and if you don't know personalization is going to explode for times like this father's day that's coming up so you don't want to miss this i want to share it all with you coming up next All right, so when we jump on Etsy and we look at these type of products for Father's Day, one of the things we definitely want to focus on is adding in customization. And when you go down a little bit further, typically we see the customization is being somebody's name or the dad established on a certain day like we have here or putting someone's name on the shirt. But the type of personalization, the type of customization we're talking about adding in today, all these type of doodle style designs that's bringing in a custom photo of the dad that you can actually put on the designs. And this is this type of design style that's blowing up that's doing extremely well and we definitely want to utilize chat gpt to help us along with that and we can see some additional data here where this person is just creating a sweatshirt creating a t-shirt that's bringing in the customization of the photo into the design itself in this doodle type of design this is an etsy pick so we know this is doing extremely well this one here as well is bringing in the same type of theme taking a personal photo and bringing in this type of cartoon pencil style design again we see 60 people bought this t-shirt in the last 24 hours so this is definitely Definitely something we want to focus on and start bringing into our shop. Same thing with this one here. Very easy design to do, as you're going to see with ChatGPT. Bring in a custom photo here and create this as a personalized product with this pencil style design. Again, 26 people bought this in the last 24 hours. And even bringing in this type of cartoon style as well is doing extremely well. Again, we see this doing well here with there being a custom photo. But again, 54 people bought this in the last 24 hours. There's a lot to design here, a lot of opportunities. But again, this will be challenging without chat gpt and print on demand i'm gonna share with you the type of product you need to sell but also how to get the right prompt to create this type of design here for your product utilizing chat gpt so the first thing we want to do is identify the type of product we want to sell now if you're new to printify printify is where i create all of my print on demand products the reason for this is that they have a ton of products you can create and they connect seamlessly with etsy so that the only thing you really got to focus on is creating your design uploading your design and start selling again when you get an order from etsy it goes to printify so printify know exactly the customer's name the address and the price of the product so that you can just focus on designing now this is just a sample of products you can choose but again if we head over to catalog you'll see they have a lot for you to sell and our example today will stick with sweatshirts for men but there's a lot here that you can definitely choose from a lot here you can definitely gravitate to now the sweatshirt that we're going to focus on today is the gilded 1800 series and that's one of the best ones i have found and so we definitely want to get started here and we're going to create start designing now from here the main thing we want to focus on is that we have the right canvas size now this is going to matter when you are creating your canvas for whatever design software you're going to choose in our case today we're going to jump into kittle because we're going to use that chat gpt image to bring over into kittle to upscale our product so that being said i want to head over to kittle i want to go to new project and i want to put in my custom size here which will be exactly what printify tells us now is everything good to go i'm going to hit create and now i have my canvas if i do want to add some additional text if i do want to upscale my image this just gives me the opportunity to go further to add in customizations if i do want to choose that route so if you do want to utilize printify for this process I make sure I leave all the details down in my description box below. You were able to get started absolutely for free to get access to all of these products. I make sure I leave all of these options down in my description box below. All right, so now we're going to jump into chat GPT. And this is where we're going to create that custom doodle style image. Now, with that being said, we're going to grab a photo from Google. But if you are using this in a real case, then you grab your photo from your customer and add it here. So in our case, we're going to add in our photo here. And the prompt that we want to give to get these type of doodle style design is this prompt to create this image into a doodle style using a thin line design only of the people in the image and remove any facial features. And the reason for this is that all of these designs we do well do not have any facial features. So we definitely want to incorporate this type of design style into our product as well. So going back into chat GPT, we have our custom photo and now we're going to hit generate image and we'll see what we gather as a result. All right, so here's what we gather as a result. I think that us having the outline of our image. And again, this came out well for us to start adding to our design 
design and if we do want to copy this all we have to do here is hit download save this to our computer and now we can upload this into Kittle and start adding additional things but I think this design alone can do extremely well so now that we have our doodle style design we can add this into Kittle if we want here and this is good if you do want to put a custom date to this and also upscale the image so we're going to make this a little bit larger here now I'm simply going to upscale the image here and now that the image is upscale this is going to print out extremely well and now I also need to remove the background as you can see here our background I just made darker so we can see it but then the image it does have that white in there so we definitely want to remove that here so I'll click remove background and now that is removed as well and that's just an easy way for you to make sure that your image quality is high and that the background is removed again there's a lot of different platforms to do this on I like utilizing Kittle because everything is there and even if we do want to add in text we can add in text as well we can change the font style if we want but just for today's video we'll keep it here just for now and so everything is good here we head over to share we hit download we're going to remove the background here and now this is going to be uploaded into our project so we head back over to here we we'll go ahead and grab our design drag and drop our design here and so this came out extremely well as we can see here this is a great product to start creating and selling on Etsy as we can see here now what we have found with these products is that the placement of the design is in the pocket style of the shirt so we definitely want to follow that same trend so in our case today we'll shrink this up just a little bit here on the corner and now that is following that style that we know to do extremely well having it in the pocket area of our sweatshirt we do want to see what this looks like we head over to preview here and we can see exactly how that comes out and I think that came out extremely well again this is perfect for us to start creating and designing for especially with Father's Day right around the corner this could be a easy design you can start getting up and start selling on Etsy and we see the data is true right 54 people bought this in the last 24 hours again we have this one here 26 people this one here 60 people and as you can see very simple to do with chat gpt bringing in that design style adding in the small bit of customization and then making this stand out even more by putting this on a sweatshirt that we know to do extremely well and so this is a great product to start creating and designing for father's day that could help you make massive sales on etsy all right so as you can see creating this custom product is really easy to do when you're combining chat gpt and printify to create these personalized products and if you're not getting these things ready right now for father's day and even for other holidays moving forward you could be missing out on huge sales i hope today's video was helpful so you can see what is possible utilizing ai designs and print on demand now you might be new to selling on etsy and you're not sure how to get sales or even how to get this product up and listed well i have created my step-by-step -step guide to etsy sales this is my step-by-step -step process where i share with you how to find top trending products how to use keywords how to list your products and even how to market your product well to be seen on Etsy and I share with you even further four exclusive videos that will show you how to do things well above the rest of the competition so you can start making sales right now so if you want to get access to my super simple guide to Etsy sales simply put in the comment section below the word sales and I'll be happy to send this over to you today now check out this next video here where I share with you another top trending AI product you can create if you want to check out that next video click here and subscribe to my channel to learn more about how to make income online with Etsy as always my friends my name is Jay and I will see you in the next video.